Yo, what up, you guys? Well, y'all know me. It's Kika Unduka for WAF Clan TV and Kika Unduka Kicks Brian, whatever you want to call me. Yeah, so today we're going to be doing a custom list view. I'm going to show you guys how to design a custom list view. Uh, if you were in class today, March 22nd, 2017. If you were in class, you probably noticed the activity, was it, or yeah, the the class activity we were given, where we were asked to create a login page, a register page, and a list view, which each page would be linked to one another. And if you watched my first tutorial, I showed uh, the first and second, I showed how to create the login and register pages and also how to link the buttons there was no database connection or anything just linking the buttons so today I'm not going to be designing the login page and the register page what I'm going to be doing however is showing you how to design a list view so yeah I named the project design if you remember so I'm going to click that and it's viewed in the gradle now let's see what we got here we have the home let's see what's in the home so basically there's nothing here so we could use this and let's see the layout no home, home layout and nothing we haven't touched anything oh yeah apart from this I kind of try to use the background use my picture as a background but I changed my mind oh yeah all right so uh why is this thing still showing error oh yeah all right, so yeah, this is our app. This is the home page, and we have the login page. We have the register page as well, and we have the login coding here. And this was the part we used to link the buttons in the text view, if you remember clearly. And here also and for the register this is where we linked and we use this one to make the text toast so what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be changing this let's change okay there's no need to change this really the button the the login button which takes you to the home page there's no need to change it because we're going to be using the home page to display the list view so we have home dot class there's no need to change that we're gonna leave that like that however what we're gonna be doing is editing the layout so we'll come to activity home and it's pretty simple really creating the list view is simple very very simple it's just like linking the buttons now we scroll down scroll 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 on the palette we have scroll view, list view in the containers. So we're gonna take list view because list view is what we're gonna be using. And I'm just gonna drop this right here. And bang, match parent, match parent, boom. What we're gonna do now is give it an ID. I'm gonna call it kicks LV. And now you see it generated this item one, sub item, blah, blah, blah. This is automated. So, if you check the text section of the of the design you can find this of the layout the text section of the layout you can find this list view under blah 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 these are the properties so <coughs> now we're gonna get into the Java side and get into the real coding really so let's do this people Home. 
and first thing we need to do is we need to set an array for every single thing we're gonna be putting in our list view and for that since we're gonna be using most of them are strings we're gonna put string and a straight bracket okay so you can give it any name you want list items I'll call this list items equals new string open curly brackets close curly brackets and close this so now in here is where we're going to be typing all the items we want to appear on our list so uh, I'm going to be writing the list of modules we've done so far for software engineering so let me just say I'll pick five or, or six I don't know let me just type a few so I think software development software development come out of the quotes type comma and you keep doing that till you get enough to you fulfill all you want uh, operating systems comma uh, formal methods Comma. Uh, what else have we done? Say, uh, mm, usability engineering. Oh, sorry, I forgot to put the quotes. You see, it's suggesting stuff for me now. Usability engineering. Okay, so how many is this? This is four. Let me add one more, and that should be okay. Mm. let's say database systems come on why do I keep forgetting to put the schools database systems so for the final one you don't need to add a comma and you just close your quotes come out and yeah that's it so now we've set up the list that the list items but hey these are just there nothing's gonna work if you run it you're not gonna see anything but what you need to do is sorry let me just give this a little space I like seeing the space there because sometimes it's just irritating yeah and it's better you you find it easier to see your coding and detect errors when you have space on your work so if I run this now, it's just gonna show me a blank page, I think. I'm not too sure. But we can check that out what happens when you run it, but definitely it's not gonna show the list I just created. So let's see what happens when that when I try that. Alright guys, so I run the app on my phone right now and if I click login here, you see this is the home page and there's nothing at all if you notice. It's empty but on the on Android studio you see that list uh, what do you call it you see the list of lists <laughs> of list items I guess that's what we could call that we see the list view showing item 1 sub item 1 item 2 sub item 2 and stuff like that but really that's not what is going on so let's get back to it and I'm going to show you guys how we can make this display what we have typed in alright guys so we're back to Android Studios now and I'm going to show you guys how to get back how to make the uh, list view show so we want our items to show definitely so I'm going to be showing you how how we can do that and so let's get to it if you remember in the previous tutorial I think it was the second one 
when I did the register and the login activities and started the Java code inside, I explained that whatever you want to use in your Java coding, you need to declare it like this final edit the text name edit text find view by id with the type final the type variable type again find view by id r dot id dot the id so it's exactly what we're going to do here if you look at the activity home xml it only has the list view which we added this is the component tree if you look at it we only have the list view and it's the one we added so and really that's only that's the only thing we're going to be working with so we're going to have to type that in final list view so say list view call it list view equals list view find view by id r dot id dot kicks lv i called if you remember the id i gave it there was kicks lv so kicks list view and now we're going to set an adapter the adapter an array adapter it works like the intent so it's going to call the items which we've listed here and it's going to put it in the list so let's practice that and show you, and you see how it goes so we're going to say area adapter uh, give it a variable so I'm going to say kicks adapter because I'm selfish yes I said that equals new array adapter and now we're going to call the class which is home because this is the page right we're working on the, the class is home so we're going to say home dot this comma android dot r dot layout dot excuse me sorry that was a question uh, a comma so the simple dot simple list item one i'm not too sure what this does but it's essential if you want your your list item to show so now you're going to put a comma again and it's now time for us to call our array since this is an array adapter we're going to call this now and we called it list items this was the variable we gave it and so i'm going to type that here comma list items and close so now it's here but just once again like the intent function this will not work until the adapter is set if you remember when it comes to the intent function when we use dot start activity yeah but here what we're going to be using is the set adapter so let's get to it we'll call this a kicks adapter so sorry 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 we'll say um this view list view dot set adapter and now we'll call the kicks adapter sorry i pressed that by mistake the kicks adapter and yeah so this is it let's run it and see what we got if we have a beautiful system and i'm going to plug my phone in right now why is it not detecting okay there it is so it's going to run on my phone i'm going to switch it to my phone in the next one minute all right so it's installing now I'm just gonna stop this. All right, guys. So I run the app now, and yeah, if we click login, we're gonna see the list view. So and here, this is the list view. But if you notice, when we click all this, nothing works. So that's what we're gonna be doing in the next tutorial. We're gonna set on click list now for every single one of them, 
and not just the click we're not just gonna make them click we're gonna make them show text i think in class our lecturer was trying to do the position numbers maybe one two three four five he was trying to do that i'm not too sure and i'll try to see if i can do that as well i don't know if i can yet so in the next tutorial for sure though i'm going to show you how to make these uh list items work when when they are when they are clicked so thanks for watching this video i'm kicks brian for wife clean tv and kika unduka and make sure you subscribe to the channel comment anything you don't understand like i said i always mention this no question is stupid there's no question uh there's no small question or no easy question no hard question there are all questions if you don't know something please make sure to ask me and i'll try to explain it to the best of my ability yeah so you can leave comments down below and make sure you like this video and subscribe to the channel once again i'm kicks brian and thanks for watching Tats all of my dollar, I ain't blowing over my cola. What? Tats all of my dollar, yeah. Tats all of my dollar, yeah. Tats all of my dollar, I ain't blowing over my cola. What? Work hard and get paid. I got dollars out of my pain. I so hard in this game.